Thank you so much for coming over uh, to the Snorper Conservancy today. I'm really very excited from that email your dad sent. It's fantastic. Yeah. Your fundraising effort is, is incredible. Tell us all about it. How did all this start? How did you learn about snow leopards? Well, I first became interested in snow leopards um, quite maybe like uh, five, six years ago. And uh -huh. um, it all started, I got uh, some books as a present, this large um, kind of picture book called World Above the Clouds that had a lot of writing in it, but as well as um, large pictures of snow leopards. And um, I had also seen some snow leopards on planet Earth documentary and um, I became kind of fascinated and it had a list of um, ways to protect snow leopards in the back of the book uh -huh. and so in like websites and things like that and so um, that uh, that kind of started me off uh -huh. you know that's that's neat because what started me off too was just seeing the snow leopard in the picture and for me it was a National Geographic I don't know whether you'd seen them in there but Beautiful cat, huh? Yeah, yeah, absolutely amazing. Yeah. Uh, you've seen them, I assume, in the zoo, and yes. I hope that one day you can go to the wild. Tell us yeah. about what you might do in the future. Well, I hope to um, work with people living in the um, in the area where they exist, um, and talk to them. Maybe go on um, like camping, not camping, but uh, into the field um, where uh -huh. they where they are and uh, hopefully get to see one and using tracking devices and whatnot but yeah yeah well that'd be fantastic it's from you know i know from my experience and dada's experience that it's really quite an incredible landscape yeah. uh, and the people culturally are very rich and, and quite different from americans right so you've got something really to look forward to yeah I'm now, sure. I understand that you've got a check f to help with this kind of conservation overseas? Yeah, so um, over the past like year I've been um, making paintings uh, and oh, recently, like last winter, I um, turned them into greeting cards uh, over a website and um, I, was a I started selling them early this year and uh, on a website and um, my mom helped me quite a bit actually my mom and my dad um, helped me set up the website uh -huh. and uh, get get um, I wrote an email to some friends and uh, saying that um, to s s saying about what I was doing and I mean right away it started I knew um, after the first week or so that it was becoming quite successful and that was very, um, I was, it was a huge confidence booster. I bet those cards are being bought by all sorts of people. Do you know how far afield people have ordered them from? Um, I've got some, one person uh, from Wyoming, another person from, I think even my farthest was around uh, New York. It was all in the country, but um, I was happy to see that it wasn't just people I knew who were getting the cards. I actually got quite a few people who I hadn't heard about it, I heard about them, but they bought the cards and one of them um, wrote a review and that was uh, very nice that they didn't know me, but they were just um, happy with what I was doing and oh, that was amazing. That's wonderful. So, yeah, over the past months, um, my project has raised a lot of money and been very successful. And so um, I was able to come up with $590 um, for wow, your organization. Great. Oh, wonderful. So I'd like to present you with this check. Thank you very much, Kyle. Thank you on behalf of all the snow leopards and the herders that we work with. This really is, you know, going to make a difference to a number of families. Thank you. So thank, thank you. you, and I would hope that I'm one day you can go out and see those places yourself. I hope so too, I really so do. So this is great. I will take this to Joyce, our accountant, and uh, she will set up a little account and we'll report back to you how we thank spend you. the money. Thank you so much. And let me shake your hands. Great, look at that.